so it's your girl April, Mumsy, and May, and we're back to do a video on some taste testing by Munch Pack. So, of course, I had to include my two favorite people in the whole wide world, which is my daughter. So, this one right here, Nay, barely comes in any videos. She's kind of like camera shy, right? Yeah. And this one right here, well, she invited herself because it was basically a me and a thing, but we love to include all of our family members. So we have a box here, which is by Munch Pack, and this is a subscription that has different snacks from all over the world. So, of course, they did send this to me, and we are about to do this together. Did you get the ones out the fridge, too? Yeah. Okay. So, we're about to do this together and see how these taste. We did see some familiar products in there from Japan. Was it Japan or Korea? Mm, Japan. Okay. So, before we even start snacking on these, I'm just going to tell you about the different munch packs. So, they do offer three different Munch Pack box sizes. The Munch Pack Minis, which come with five plus snacks. The original Munch Pack, which comes with 10 plus snacks. And the Family Pack, which comes with 20 plus snacks. So I do believe that we are going to be taste testing the 10 because a 20 snacks are a lot to be taste tested. And I already told y'all I'm on a diet. So a girl is really not trying to be messing up the diet, okay? So, you also can add drinks to your munch packs like coffee, juice, tea, soda. Um, also, you can either renew your subscription weekly, bi weekly, or monthly. It's up to you of how often you want to get these munch packs. But each box has an array of different foods from around the world. You can also give these to your favorite people, your friends, family, girlfriend, boyfriend, husband as a gift. Just keep in mind that you will be paying for the gift. It's a gift, so it's an ongoing, never-ending gift, okay? And if they like snacks, then yes. But I think this is really, really cool. You can um, also customize it with such things as spices, um, chips, gummy, sweet, and crunchy. Um, there are a lot of different things on the website. You can also just purchase items if you don't want to have a monthly, weekly, or bi-weekly subscription. So for those of you who like to test taste and try out different things, then check them out. I will put a promotional code below for you guys so that you can check it, but it does come in this nice box. And we did have to refrigerate a couple of items because it is, um, it does come through the mail, so it's bloody hot out here in Arizona. And yes, a couple of things might have melted. So you will get a little card sleeve that just says thank you. Hope you enjoy your munch packs. And it's made with lots of love from Anthony, the adventurous eater. So if you're an adventurous eater like these two who loves taste testing, I'm really not all for the taste testing, but I'm going to give it a try. You can also download their scanner app, which tells you what's going to come in your next box. And it is available for Android and Google. Um, Android and app and the app store, the Apple. So yeah, so this is our box. And it's a bunch of stuff. And so we are about to try this out. You girls ready? Yeah. Excited? Mm -hmm. You are? Okay, so what do you want to try? Oh, so we have something to drink in case it's nasty. So we have a drink here. What is this, Nay? It's hot tar soda. So Nay, don't you drink these? Yeah but they're usually in the glass bottle. With that bowl? Mm-hmm. So this, okay, so what does it taste like when you be drinking these? Uh, like soda, like a basically flavored soda, orange soda, strawberry. Fruity okay. flavor. You had some before? Yeah. Okay. So this is from Japan, right? Mm-hmm. So it says, what is it, Hata? Yeah. Hata soda, Hata soda is an invigorating drink known as marble soda. So explain to them what it normally looks like besides the can. It normally looks like the glass bottle here with the bead inside. Um, the only reason why the bead is inside is to basically stop you from drinking so much at one time. And yeah, it's basically it. Okay, so, so I've got all my English accent from around the world. So we have some late July snacks. They're called classic tortilla chips jalapeno lime made, made with organic corn. I don't really like anything jalapeno. What about you? Oh, I see stuff. Yeah. Huh? 
jalapenos. Oh, you like spicy stuff. You be eating those Takis. Mumsy will sit there and kill a bag of Takis. I don't like anything spicy at all. Damn. Oh my god. To me, they taste good. They taste like off brand Doritos. Yeah! Off brand Cool Ranch Doritos, right? Mm -hmm. What do you think? Same. Yeah, they taste like fake Doritos. The, um, the first one kind of tastes like those crackers you always buy in those kind of bags. The red and white bag? Mm-hmm. Oh, uh, okay, okay. They're not that, they're not even that spicy. Which is good because I don't like them. They don't taste bad though. Okay, Mumsy, you get to pick next and what we're going to try. I want this. Okay. Waffle. Caramel filled Dutch treat. Um, wafer, a waffle cookie inspired by the traditional Dutch treat. So we we may need a little tea with this. A little tea. You know, a little bit of tea, caramel filled. And it's gluten free. For those of you guys who don't like gluten, I like gluten. What about you? Mm -hmm. You don't like gluten? No. You like gluten? No. You guys don't even know what gluten is. That's why I don't like it. <laughs> It looks like it's like a nutty bar. A nutty bar. With the the it's like oh the, the things that mom's like yellow packaging box. Yeah, but these are awful thin, so mm. I like it. Huh? I like it. You like it? You know what it tastes like? It tastes like those um. You know those things, those cream pies, and they the ones you always buy for. I know I always eat those. I like those. They have the cream inside, mm -hmm. the raisin on yeah, the outside. That's what it tastes like. I feel like it tastes like um a little heavy oatmeal thing. That's what I'm talking about. The oatmeal pies. That's what they call. Mm-hmm. They they would probably taste really good. With some tea, tea crumpets. You know. Yes. Your turn <laughs> to choose. Uh, I don't know what that says. It's like Nim to Boomki or Boomkai. I don't know. It's a foreign language. <laughs> what does it say? It's Nim Boomki something. Either Boomki or Boomkai. What is it? Mi n what? Nim Boomkai. Whatever it is, it's fruity. You forgot the two. Nim to Buki. Oh, I think Moose. I think that's what I think you pronounced it right. Nim to Buki. I don't think this is Japanese. I said no. Japanese. Um, this looks like what does it say? Nim to Booms. Oh, Booms. Oh, well, the no. back says Booms. Oh, yeah, it's product of Germany. Okay. Oh, they look cute. Um. I don't know. Is it fruity? It's sort of like a sour taste on the inside. You know what it tastes like? This one. Okay, you know those old, old those candies that old people be having, and they got the strawberry paper, mm -hmm. and they always be in a candy dish next to the peppermints. It tastes just like them strawberry candies, and then if you chew them inside, they kind of like. Gushy or whatever. Mm -hmm. Cherry. Mmm. Sour. Mmm. Bite it. I did. I bite it. It's sour. It's sour, right? Did you taste the? It's not that sour. Mmm. -hmm. Mm mmm. Okay, so Mumsy picked this. We had to do it over because the camera cut off. So these were the croissants. They are a pastry filled with strawberry jam. And it was cute little croissants, so they taste like like a jam. Oh. Really, um, it just tastes like soft bread with strawberry jam. 
Yeah. You don't like it? Okay. Oh, because you don't like jelly and jam. Mm -hmm. Not you. Okay. This tastes like a bread, right? Soft bread. Okay. Okay. <laughs> so these um, are the Tom Yum flavored pretzels. They're like little pretzel sticks from Japan. These. So it's got this really, really ugly little shrimp on it. Mm. Like a little snack, a stick. These are really good. I really like them. Mm hmm. I don't like them. You don't like them? She says it's good. Remind me of spicy ramen. Really? Yeah. Mm mm. And that's all I kind of eat. <laughs> I mean, they taste like chicken and a biscuit crackers, you know. The blue box with the little rooster on it that I buy and I never get to eat. Mm. This would taste good with some sour cream on it. Dip it in there. Mmm. I like these. So whose turn is it now? Mine. Okay. Who knows? Wait, it's yours because it's... I don't know. I don't know. Oh, it's strawberry. Strawberry flavored. Pokey sticks. Look, show them on the back. It looks cute. Oh. It looks kawaii. Kawaii? <laughs> She's like, it looks kawaii. So what is it? Those are the same company as these. Nay eats these all the time. Tell them all about your pocky pokey sticks. Oh, um. Uh, to show it on the camera. You're not really showing. Oh. This is the packaging. Let's keep the... Isn't that what they all look like? No. Oh, what they look like? They look like, oh, oh, it's just it's like a silver that has the name on it. On like the this? Like this bag? But it's usually white. Yeah. Oh. The special ones come in like different packaging. Oh, so we're going to eat those. Mm -hmm. So they're sticks again. They're strawberry flavored sticks. Okay, so they look like this. But they're sticks. Um, if you just buy them quicker. They're sticks. And they're just like breaded sticks. My kids eat these all the time. We get them from like the grocery store. And it's this brand or... I don't really know what they... They like about them so much, but... But you don't like the strawberry. I like the strawberry. It's the same one. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> okay, well. These. Okay, so we got a bag of cola candy. And these are Japanese. They look like chocolate, I think. Let's see. Oh, it's a bag full of these. Let me check with the candy gummies. Oh, they're hard candies. Mmm, smell like the candy. Wonder where it's from. It's Japan, right? Because. It looks like, no, it must be South Korea because of the wording. Mm. Oh, well, they yeah. the Asian culture, so. Because Japanese, Chinese, and South Korea. Korea. Yeah. Part of the Korea. Because the wording's different. Mm. Oh, look at that. And she even knew. She was like, the wording is different. I thought it was from Japan. She was like, no, the wording is different. And she said, from Korea. And she was right. Oh, my legs are being you can't do that on video. <laughs> you can't do it on video. These are nasty. I like them. They taste like the good. They ones. taste like gross. I don't like them. It's like medicine at first, but then it tastes pretty good. These are not cream filled wafer cookies. The taste of Vienna. Okay, so yes. Taste of Vienna. That's what it says. Oh, well, it's not a sausage. Like, you know. It's like a country, you know. Hazelnut. Like oh, these wafers? are right little wafers. Like you know, little wafers, like little tea and cookies. There goes one for you. There goes one for you. The tea and cookies. Thank you. Oh, Let chocolate. It's it is. It is. It's hazelnut. It's really not. But you know. Mm -hmm. It's alright. It tastes like those wafers that you buy. I hated these cookies as a kid. Oh, that's no, the true. wafers. They would, was a nasty after they would give you as a kid. I hated them. They just taste like styrofoam and just just 
foolishness. I hate those cookies. You know the taste of styrofoam? No. <laughs> no, but you know how something tastes like it looks like? You oh, know what I mean? yeah. Like, I hated these cookies. They will always get... These are like for the cheap parents. Like, who buy those wafer cookies? You get like 500 for a dollar. I like those cookies. Do you? You see, I never buy them. I hate those cookies. The vanilla ones. I hate every last one of them. Because they're a mess. And it tastes like styrofoam. I always want to get them, but you never say, always say no. I don't know. I always say no because I think they're so cheap. Like, And I hated them as a kid. But if you want them, I'll get them. So the last thing we're going to have is the Hata. Mm -hmm. The Hata soda. We're just going to give you the rest of it. Because you love stuff like that. It tastes good. It's a mess. Mm, I like that. Do you? It tastes like like nothing. I don't even. It doesn't even have like a strong taste to me. You better share some of my glasses. You better share some of that with me, eh? It tastes good. <laughs> it sounds like a stalker. You better share some of that with me, eh? I mean, it doesn't taste nasty, but I'd rather have regular soda. But it says it's invigorating, whatever they mean by that for a soda. But you know, it's invigorating. Y'all are really gonna sit up here and drink that too, huh? Okay, my love, so that was our fancy eating for today, correct? Mm -hmm. And I hope you guys enjoyed the video with me and two of my daughters. I actually have three and two boys. Five kids, cheerio. You can check out Munch Pack. I will post all of the information down below for you guys. They have snacks from all over the world and you can try them out on a weekly, bi-weekly, or monthly basis. So make sure you rate, comment, subscribe, check the description box. And on that note, stay diva and delicious. We will see you again soon on another video and we love you and goodbye. Bye.